honestly, I gotta. <laughs> we're gonna go over here, but we're gonna have a long talking to with K after that. <laughs> like, goodness. All right. Well, we got Sativa and we got Vega both back. Both here in losers, so losers round four. Yeah. Uh, probably the round to make it out. Uh, three or four here, but. Rob, Mewtwo, could be a jungle fest for either. Yeah, absolutely. Both big hurt boxes, both big characters with big conversions off projectiles. But it's doing it a little bit differently in their arsenal. There's a down to though, big scoops. Mewtwo ain't got that in this game. Still go fair. And this is the Rob gameplay, right? Just constantly extending the arms out and fair down tilt, fair down tilt. And there's not much you can do. Mewtwo also, like you said, a criminally light a little bit earlier. And that can come into play really kind of detrimentally versus Rob. Oh, yeah. Rob the scrapper. There's a down tilt. Point at the shoes. See what you got on them. Punish them, of course. A gyro oh, into nah. the left barrel ball. <laughs> It gets reflected, and when do you ever see Rob go for the reflect? No, nah, never, never. The blatant, like reflect like that in a matter of moments, never, never see it like that. Uh, great stuff from from Sativa there. Oh my God, like what a great call out. Just quick thinking, and that's what you got to do. Uh, good first game because my goodness, like that was that was a little bit close. Absolutely. We'll see what we can get in game two now. Sativa versus Vega. I'm not sure where either of these guys are from, but regardless, uh, it's been a kind of a close set uh, so far. Yeah, that's the thing. That's the beauty of the quad stream. We see eight players essentially at a time, and they could be from all over here, but still uh, Sativa getting a really nice nair from ledge, but it seems like Vega's starting to get the spacing back in that you need to win this matchup, but the problem is once Rob gets in, it's very dangerous no matter what. Absolutely. Okay, oh, what's the role we next? Let it right. Maybe it's a little bit off on the spacing, and oh my god, again, points down at the shoes. Mad disrespectful. And he's just saying, you know what, get him out of here. Okay, trying to get something converged in the down tilts right there. Avoids the gyro note. Honestly, I feel like through all of our sets that we've had on the quad stream, that we have only seen just like aggressive gameplay. Like, yeah. we really haven't seen what people kind of knock ultimate for, which is like that chill, passive gameplay. <laughs> we have only really seen like aggressive, mashing in your face type of gameplay. And I personally love to see it uh, down till into the up air. Doesn't quite do it. Looking for the side swipe of the forward air. Unable to find a great tech coming out from Sativa. Right, I guess he S match as well. Catches Vega slipping, taking the first off after getting pressure for so long. Wants to drop Gyro onto the grab, but can't find it. Great answer back from Vega. Okay, here we go. I like just the teleport yeah, out. Yeah, I don't want to be in that corner. Yeah, exactly. Especially when you're Mewtwo, there's Rob Gyro, but instant drop here is going to be a Vega who is prioritizing holding that center here, but it's looking very close right now. I love the respect that Vega is giving Sativa, but the problem is, you know Rob's going for that Gyro toss Ooh. side special. One of the down air conversion off the gyro nearly got spiked themselves for it. Both these guys are just in love with our reversals. Okay, gyro to your face. Yeah, right, like definitely does not feel good. The the thing is about Rob is that even chip damage feels bad, right? Absolutely. Like even in like down tilts, uh, gyros in face, like just doesn't feel good. And gyro going to lead into that up smash here. Huge lead for Sativa right now. Scooping him up, okay, love that gyro to the grab to keep you in shield. Yeah, it's scared now. You don't want to be scared against big bad Rob. Thing is, what does save Mewtwo, I guess, in this matchup is the recovery can be a little bit long, right? Sure. Uh, but it finds wow. the back air. The problem is it doesn't take the stock, and if it's one character that's going to live all the way through, it is going to be Rob. No tech, though. Tries to get the roll in, but not there in time. The up tilt does at least, like, scoop up just a little bit, but there's the forward air coming out from Vega, trying to get something started. We still got to get this first stock. No tech. Huge. Ooh, just floats to the ledge. Thank God Mewtwo is the floaty. Once the forward air conversion, air dodging for his life, and then you see Sativa still living. Shadow Ball is fully charged. Go watch out. That side being very unsafe. <laughs> Charges the down smash as well. Why not? I was about to say, I don't think Vega's going to let you get that a second not time. You know what I'm saying? But there it is. Trying to read down, but does not find the follow up here. So still trying to get something started. Down tilts a plenty. And now it is just back down to the spacing where both players just trying to find their opening. Will Vega find it? But the nair almost does it off the top and wow. is so close. Okay, you gotta watch out now. The Nair is a little bit unsafe, but has to space it away. That baby shadow ball trying to run, uh, run behind it, trying to get any kind of grab conversion. Big trade with a down tilt, it's always gonna work in Rob's favor. That is a frame three move, Lyric. Ooh, oh, he gets a fusion! The down smash not going to be enough! 
it up just yet, but we're getting real close, Fabs. I mean, Vega has done a lot with this one stock, 151 on the Mewtwo, just almost like the Dex number, but it does not matter. Finds the up smash here. Sativa going to go up 2-0 in the set, but that was looking real close. I definitely want to highlight, though, Nugget. Sativa, but you do feel like Vega can win some of these games, these trades just need to go in their favor. Yeah, the problem is is that uh, for Sativa to take a stock, there's significantly less inputs you need, in my opinion, yeah. than you two, right? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Like, like a couple down tilts here and there, finds the, the Nair and into getting something started with the Pineapple from Pokemon Stadium 2. That one's gonna hurt. Damn, I have nothing neutral about that, I'll tell you that. That's the kind of fixation I've ever done seen one. Okay. Drag down there, up tilt course, yep, loops, maybe. But never mind, the gyro's still putting that all to bed. Yeah, I mean, like, Vega's finding the openings when possible, but it's just like, oh, like, it, it ends just a little, like, an interaction too early for it to continue going. And look at Sativa just putting so much pressure on a Vega here in the corner. But I like the down tilt. The hits are going to trade, and there's the reflection again. I mean, it's definitely doable, but Vega's got to work overtime for this one. Won't get the stock just yet. That's a heartbreaker. Absolutely. Oh, man. There it is there, though. Okay, not too bad. That you know that SD didn't really uh, help in, their, uh, in this game. It's something to prove right now, though. Okay, here we go. A couple catches here. I love how Mewtwo doesn't even catch the item, but what Mewtwo will catch is that back air. Is Sativa gonna win 3-0? But those are one of those times, Vaz, where we're right in the challenge. It was close. It was close for sure. We're gonna have to move on to the next. 